Yeah, my name's Will, also known as Mosaic Will or Mr. Mosaic, uh, and uh, I'm effective, uh, funny enough, I'm a mosaic artist. And I have been making mosaics what well, seems like ever now. 2007 is when I first started making mosaics, and since then I've uh, been doing work for all manner of different kinds of people. I've gradually kind of like built my name up, but the thing that seemed to launch me into the sort of like uh, the realms of I don't know, the popular press and people kind of like having me on their radar was I started creating pieces of street art because our city of Southampton has had some really good public art trails but they're often only temporary so I thought we need to have something that's going to be a little bit more permanent than that so um, I started off by creating little sets of eyes and sticking them all over the place they didn't get didn't get much traction from them so started doing front covers on the mr man started sticking them all over the place sat back and waited to see what the reaction was going to be it was really positive you know it was so positive that effectively by the time the council realized what i was doing it was too late to stop me effectively because everybody had fallen in love with what i'd done and the city is now um covered Prolific is the word that the, um, the Daily Echo described me up as uh, the cover covered in mosaics. What I want, what I really want people to be um, be thinking is that it's kind of like the last thing that they'd be expect to see on their way to work in the morning. <laughs> so yeah, it's great. Have you? What? How did you know I was here? Oh. Okay. Have you bugged me? So one of the techniques that I that I use as well when I'm when I'm putting mosaics up on the wall if I don't if I don't want people to bother me then I will uh, I've got my own custom high vis jacket so I wear a high vis jacket because people ignore people if they're wearing, wearing high vis jackets just leave you alone completely so I wear a high vis jacket and then to make it even to make it an even more solid cast iron urban disguise I've got totally legit artist printed on the back of my high-vis jacket so when I wear it it's obvious you know not only am I wearing a, a high-vis jacket so I must be doing something okay totally legit with it you know it's good what is my role in the community so I see my role is to entertain people in the city and to inspire them and hopefully some of them are going to be able to think well okay what can I do what can I do to benefit the city of Southampton how, how can I add a flavor that's missing to um, a city that has already got a lot of culture but I think our culture needs to be highlighted and the best way to do that is to come do the kind of thing that I'm doing so if people want to be successful you need to break a few rules I'm so famous I'm struggling to get over myself Literally get fangirl all the time. When we were on that walk and that woman went, I saw you on your Instagram this morning. I did, I did make the quote, I don't care about politics, I just want to make people smile. And that's to do with the fact that my art doesn't need to be political. Not interested in that, don't care. There's enough of that in the world and it's boring to be frank. So I would rather just be able to do something that can literally be pretty much political, you know, politics free. Why do I just want to make people smile? Oh, because there's so much misery in life. Yeah, people are very negative. They're just, even when they don't want to be, they're still negative. So for me, smiling's really good for people. It releases you know, good endorphins or whatever it is, the chemicals in the brain that make you feel good. It also makes other people feel good so that they're feeling safe because people don't tend to smile at you before they mug you or whatever. I just don't think so. Anyway, I mean, maybe there are happy muggers out there, um, you know, uh, but I don't think so. I think if you if people smile, then it makes you feel good, makes you feel safe. So why not? Why don't we all just smile a little bit more? <laughs>